Hi guys, welcome back for another video. I am gonna do a bunch of videos today because I am bored and at home. So yeah, um, this one we will do, um, hmm. I was thinking about a couple. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do a review in this video of this baby. Now, I purchased this item from Fashion File. This right here is the Chanel Blue Lambskin. It was pre-loved whenever I got it. Oh, my stuff. Let me take that out. It was pre-loved whenever I got this. Oh, my um credit card is in here. Let's see. Take it out my phone case. that. Stick it in real quick. That way you can see it really all the way stuffed like it should be. So I got this pre-loved on Fashion File. My boyfriend bought it for me for Christmas as a gift. Um, it was a surprise. I did not know he bought it. I was looking at it for a while and really wanted it. And then it said that it sold and I was very sad. And then it turns out it was sold to him, which is really cute. Um, it came with the box. The um, cloth to buff out lambskin. It came with the authenticity card and the dust bag. And since then, I have been using this thing like crazy. It does have way more dominant stitching, like almost like a double stitching, compared to my. Oh, not really. I thought it did. My Chanel Blue Lambskin um, small pouch, small O case. I can say that this item though is a whole lot more, um, does not show the wear as much as this wallet does. This wallet I've had since Christmas. It has not been a full year and this does show wear. It shows wear Not really on any of the corners. They do have an outline, as you can see right there, from this right here, this cut into that. So that shows where from that, um, because I used to wear this in my pockets. It has since smushed the lambskin a little bit. It's not as fluffy. This also has wear from opening it up. Look at that, whenever you open it up flat, this is what happens. It gets this wrinkle going on. And that's really not good for the leather. But you know what? It's a wallet. It's beautiful. And it's Chanel. It's, it's a great quality. But the puffiness is not as puffy as it used to be at all. It is still pretty puffy. It's still nice. But it is not as good as it used to be. Because I used to keep it in my pocket. And when I would sit, my pocket would get really tight and it would smush it. Now I only use this whenever I keep this inside of a book sack or something else. Um, I do not use it in my pocket, but even though it is so tiny and it can go in my pocket, I do not use it in my pocket for the reason of I do not want to mess it up. Um, it has one credit card slot out here. The it is two right here, one behind that one in the back of this, and then one pocket right here with nothing over it. See, my hand can quite literally go through that. Um, yeah, I do really love this piece. I think this might be my very favorite wallet. More for sentimental reasons, it is my favorite wallet out of all of my wallets. Um, functionality reason, not really. But sentimentally, this is my favorite, most beautiful wallet that I do own. I love, love, love this wallet. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching my little review. Um, if you have any questions about it or if you want me to do a comparison on wear and tear between this and this, then I definitely will. Yeah. So, um, y'all have a great day. And let me know if you have any requested videos. I'm going to post, like, a lot of videos today because I'm really bored. So, thank you. Bye-bye.